What is going on, Janet? This is Darius from Auto Fair Nissan, and in front of me is a Caspian Blue 2017 Rogue SV. This Rogue SV is going to have LED daytime running lights that you can see running right now. Below it are going to be the fog lights that are included in the package. We're going to take a look at the side here. You can really appreciate the beautiful color of this car from all angles. It has a little bit of darkness when you're looking at an angle, and it's nice and bright when you're looking at it right up front. This one's going to have the alloy wheel upgrade, and you're going to see also that it does have the pinstriping body line that comes right across. Nice little touch for uh, for some class. You're going to get your chrome door handles as well as your edge protectors for your doors. It's good for preventing door dings in parking lots and things of that nature. You get privacy glass for the back seats and for the rear glass as well as a roof rail up top. So you can mount uh, kayaks, canoes, any other little small water vessels. In the back, you're also going to get an edge protector for your bumper. We'll open this up real fast. You can see how I've set up the divide and hide cargo system for you. So you can see how it works as, when you use it as like a sort of a partition storage unit back here. So it's nice and closed off in there, but I can always do this and put the whole unit down. And now I've got shelving or I can do that. Nice flat surface. It's a really good, uh, good system here for cargo and storage management. I'm going to close this up and we're going to take a look in the passenger or excuse me, back seats on the driver's side. You can see I've put down the center armrest that acts as cup holders when you put it down. I'm gonna put the seat down so you can just see, folds flat down like here. Gives you plenty of room if you're gonna utilize it like that in the back. Now, if I lift this up and pull on this little lever right here, you can see this seat also reclines. The other side does as well too. So you can, you can get the back seats pretty far back, so it's super comfortable to sit in. You take a look in the driver's seat, the most important part for you, I assume. You're gonna get your electronic controls for the seat down there. Of course, your standard controls here for your windows and everything, mirror controls right there. Take a look at the inside of this. So you're gonna get your controls for your center display right over here. Got your four wheel drive one right there because this is a part time all wheel drive vehicle with a nice intelligence system that only kicks on when it needs to. Volume controls as well as your um, your station control right there, cruise controls right here, and then your phone controls right there. This one does have automatic headlights as you can see back here, as well as this is the fog light switch. We're gonna take a look at the middle here. Nice, simple display very easy to navigate. It's got physical buttons, so there's some tactile response, so it's nice and easy to do, especially if it's dark. But you can see there, you get your Sirius XM button next to your FM AM, and then your media is gonna control like your USB input, your aux input, your Bluetooth input, and then the display will turn off the screen if you want it to. You got the rest of your audio controls here, and then this one's gonna have dual zone climate control completely independent of one another. You see, I put that one all the way up, that one's staying the same, and then I can pair them right back to where, where the driver's side is. Moving down a little bit, get in front of that shift knob. You're gonna get your USB and aux inputs as well as your 12 volt cigarette lighter style plug-in. And this screen also acts as a backup camera, by the way, for when you put it in reverse and you've got your distance judging lines there. Nice and simple, comes on on its own, of course. I'm going to take a look down here. You do get heated seats for both the driver and the passenger. You get a high and a low. And of course an off. And when you put those heated seats on, it's also going to activate your heated mirror function for the outside. You see that little symbol right there is showing you that it's heated out here. And like I said, that'll come on as soon as you put the heated seats on. Uh, overall, this is a really nice looking Rogue. Uh, the, the mileage is really low and it's got the nice almond interior. It's very pleasant to look at, very light on the eyes, and you know, it's a little bit different than what you're probably used to seeing, which is mostly black. So Jenna, if you wanna know anything more about this Rogue, give me a call. My number is 603-580-4528. Come on down to 45 Portsmouth Avenue Stratum and take it for a test drive and take it home.